what? Why? 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 Watch this. I dare you to take a step inside the house. So, you do have a duty to identify yourself, we ask, especially while conducting an investigation. I want you to understand that. Please listen to that as well, ma'am. The second thing is, again, that car back there. You can go ahead. Okay. Right. Oh, my brother, hold on. Oh, oh, hey, hey. Welcome back to We The People University. In today's video, we're going to take a look at the Clayton County Police Department, not to be confused with the Clayton County Sheriff's Office, located in Georgia. Um, we're going to take a look at some cops from the Clayton County, Georgia's police department show up to a home and there's a little confusion um, with the entire video. Okay. It's, you're going to see a lot of cuts in the video that I myself did not um, uh, do. The edits were there when I received the video, but to help explain the video, there's a couple coming home minding their business and police are outside next door investigating they're trying to make the couple help them with their investigation after refusing and trying to go inside of the home the police come over and this is what happens again what's the problem You ain't got to talk to them. That's not your car. They actually just got to serve. That's not your car. We, we don't have that. Why? Why? What you need to know my name for? As I... What's up? What's up? So you're not going to give me your name? Why do I yeah. give you my name? Because we're in the middle of an investigation. I'm asking I you a question. I have nothing to do with that. But I'm, I asked you a question, so what's your name? He just stepped down. So how you know what we talking about? I have nothing. I don't you know you. talking to me. You I came from the back. Down. I came from the exactly. back. Exactly. Because so again, if you go in the house, you're going to jail. Both of y'all. What? Why? So what? Like Obstruction. We're in the middle. You're not going to give us your name? Watch this. Uh, Please don't do that, y'all. Watch name? this. I dare you to take a step inside the house. So you're not going to yeah, give us your, your information? No, it's not my house. Okay, but understand, if, not you my step, house. If, if you take a step inside that door, right, okay, I will drag you out and put you in handcuffs. Okay. Hello? So, you do have a duty to identify yourself, we ask, especially while conducting an investigation. I want you to understand that. Please listen to that as well, ma'am. The second thing is, again, sure. that car back there. You can go ahead. I'll give you a right. oh, my brother, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Lady, lady. Don't go around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. I can't turn around. I can't turn around. Ain't nobody touching you right now. Turn around. Bro, ain't nobody touching you right now. Turn around. What is going on? Sir, my name is Nisi. 
I don't know what the fuck happened. I didn't even see anybody be on anybody's car or whatever you're talking about. I have nothing to do with that. All I know. Why? Why? No, 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 no. But it's not for Clayton County. Why does it? No, yes, it does. No, it does not. It's not for. Put your hand like you're praying. I'm trying to tell y'all what's going on. It's not for Clayton County, though. Mm -hmm. I don't even have to be for this county. Y'all know better. No, it's for whatever county it is. You got a warrant. Can I get a number? Can I get my numbers at the house? Can you get the numbers for me? So the woman in the video, we see that she was released and this sometimes happens. If uh, you arrest someone based on a warrant that they may have, the other county uh, where the warrant is stemming from may choose not to um, come and pick those individuals up. So from that point, uh, you may release them. I have done that several times. If someone has a warrant and the other county says, hey, we're not going to come and get them, then you release them. As for the man in this video, he was also released after being bloodied a little bit. Um, I'm guessing due to the fact that one, he literally had nothing to do with their investigation that was happening maybe a house or two over. Um, and two, he, they forced his identification out of him and then later let him go. This is the tyranny as we all know it. Didn't do shit, bro. Bro, people get bullied, they have to go to jail. I don't know who the officer in this video was or any of those officers, but here's one thing I do have. I still know officers who work for that department. So it's going to be my goal to see if I can find out and I'll keep you guys updated. But the actions of these officers are not surprising. Again, this is the Clayton County Police Department and not to be confused with the Clayton County Sheriff's Office, but Clayton County period is it has this way of doing things and if you guys are familiar just this year the clayton county sheriff himself was arrested and sentenced to prison for violating the rights of citizens well a federal judge in atlanta has sentenced former clayton county sheriff victor hill to prison time this comes after a jury convicted hill in october on six counts of violating the constitutional rights of detainees inside the jail violating the constitutional rights of detainees inside the jail fox high's claire sims has covered this case since the beginning she is live outside the federal courthouse with reactions of what has been a high profile case claire yeah, good afternoon, Christine. I sat next to one of the victims in the courtroom as the judge handed down Hill's sentence and he cheered, although he later expressed disappointment that the former sheriff never apologized in any way for his actions. What were you doing in Clayton County that day? This is a democracy, sir. It's the United States. No, it's not. Not in my county. No, it's not. Not in my county. That was video used in the federal trial of former Clayton County Sheriff Victor Hill. Now, the man once tasked with upholding the law will go to prison for breaking it. Quick correction. Not this year. I forgot. We just experienced uh, January of 2024, but the Clayton County Sheriff was arrested in March of 2023. But it's to show the attitude of police officers in Clayton County. I'm pretty sure all of you guys can see the violations. Um, and the laws that are broken in this particular video. I would love to see what you guys think about it. Please put your thoughts down below. I just want to share this one and I'll be looking more into this incident to see if I can dig up more information and keep you guys posted. All right, make sure you know your rights and always record the police. With that being said, we the People University signing off.